What's going on boys and girls? I'm back with another video and I'm using hand gestures because it says that if you use hand gestures in your videos and you talk with your hands that it helps the algorithm. Now that makes zero sense to this guy. Maybe not even that guy who you can't see right now but he's there. He's playing a video game. Trust me. He really is. Say hi there. See? I don't have three hands. Anyways, so it's spring game week in beautiful, beautiful East Tennessee. And should the weather provide great comfort for us this weekend, your boy will be hanging out with Boogie Bentley and the boys at the G10 parking garage this Saturday. Got to go hang out with Boogie for a couple hours today. Had lunch with the guy. Great guy. Uh, do shows with him occasionally. We're going to start doing a Monday show once we get to football season. We're going to do a show this coming Monday after the spring game, talk about what we saw, what we didn't see, what we wanted to see, what we didn't want to see, and see if we saw what we thought what we seen was good enough. Did I use all my seesaws and scenes right there? I don't know. Grammar teachers, you let me know. Anyway, so it should be lots and lots of fun regardless of whether we see what we saw and seeing what we heard. It don't matter. We're going there to see some Tennessee football led by Josh Brick and Heupel. A guy that two years ago, Tennessee, oh man, big mad. Tennessee fans, myself included, were big mad. Why are we going to hire this guy? What the hell is Josh Heupel going to do? He ain't never done nothing. Two years later, he's responsible for one of the greatest well, the greatest turnaround in Tennessee football history in my lifetime. It took Johnny a decade to get things turned around here. But the greatest turnaround in my lifetime. And for my money, the siren that you hear right now has nothing to do with the emergency that's going on in the SEC East right now. Teams scrambling to figure out how they're going to handle this offense this year. Georgia had it figured out last year. They they had the... They had the uh, they had the key to the proverbial chest to stop Tennessee's offense last year. It was called 90-some thousand screaming, raging, mad Georgia Bulldog fans uh, making a lot of noise and disrupting our ability to hear the play calling and the whatnot and who, who to board or what have you. Uh, but that won't happen this year. That won't be a problem in Neyland. In fact, it's going to be a problem for Georgia when they come rolling in in November with one loss already under their belts. They're going to leave Knoxville with two losses. But we'll get to that in my Tennessee preview video coming up uh, sometime after the spring game. I want to see how Joe Milton's looking this far along. I want to see how Nico's looking. I want to put these four eyes on them. Not depending on what the guys that get to see practice say. I don't want to depend on what, what they've seen. Although I trust them. You know, they, they've been following Tennessee for a long time. They know what they're talking about for the most part. But I want to put my eyeballs on this machine, this Rolls Royce of an offensive juggernaut that nobody's going to be able to stop this year either. Even in the South Carolina game, we scored 38 points, 30 whatever, 30 some points. That should be enough to beat South Carolina in any year. And it'll be enough to beat them this year because they were out of their gourds that night and they'll never have another game like that in my lifetime. So South Carolina, Carolina Jackpot, Twisted Rooster, all you guys, you know you're going down when you come to Neyland. So, you know, it is what it is. Just go ahead and prepare for it and get ready. That way when it happens, you won't be upset. Jackpot won't be on here going, Ready, buddy, we come down there to rock you flop and big this, 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 this. Sweat beating off his bald head after he's had about 16 whatever he drinks. Probably Bud Light knowing Jackpot. See what I did there? You, you, you see what I did there. I know you did. Anyways, spring game this Saturday. Uh, talking balls and BBD hanging out in the G10 parking lot before the game. Uh, hope, hope we get a spot. Hope we get to see you if you're watching this video. And I uh, hope we all get to hang out and watch some Tennessee spring orange and white game go balls screw y'all's team you ain't got a shot you got a few months to prepare but it ain't gonna matter hug your mom and daddy because they love you and they put you here 
And uh, I love you. Mean it.